Breaking news. Pat Rages was a guest on American Pickers, and the Pickers are hoping to recruit her permanently. Wednesday night's edition featured Pat, owner of an antique store, who has made multiple appearances on the History Channel show in the last decade. A vibrant tin lithograph sign was purchased by host Mike Wolf from the show's antiques expert. After declaring the item to be top of the line and in really good condition, Pat finally admitted to having owned it for over four decades. Is that so? Mike exclaimed in shock. You are my hero because of that, in a businesslike tone, he inquired. What are you thinking on it? Mike shouted out. I was thinking the same thing. What if it were too grand? After that, he made a playful gesture toward their bond and said, Look at what's going on here. Are we related? Pat shot back and then she started giggling uncontrollably. I agree, Mike said. Possibly. And proceeded to extend his hand to shake his friends. His admirers showered Pat with compliments when he posted the touching encounter to Instagram. Person said, Could have Pat on every week, guys awesome. A different person said, Always a joy watching episodes with Pat and seeing his collection. A third individual wrote, one of my favorite episodes is the one where you bought the motorcycle from Pat's living room. You mentioned that it is a motorcycle like that that collectors find disturbing. At 2013, Mike discovered a Royal Pioneer motorcycle at Pat's residence, which the fan was alluding to. In 2019, Pat made a return appearance on the show when the now fired Theodore Frank, an extremely unusual cycle automobile, was purchased by Fritz at his business. On July 5, Mike, Robbie, and Danielle Colby's American Pickers episodes came back. Episode 3 of the new season had a further 100,000 audience dip, according to an exclusive report in this week's U.S. Sun. The initial episode had 918,000 viewers, whereas this installment only managed 713,000. After beloved performer Frank, 59, was fired in 2021, Fans have sworn to stop watching the show. People will only watch American Pickers if they see a rerun starring Frank, according to one commenter on the first episode. Keep going. An additional comment. The only episodes of American Pickers I watch is with F.R. Ain and K. Why did you screw Frank over? A third Twitter user asked of the show. While recuperating from back surgery, which left him with 185 stitches, and two rods in his spine. Frank made his last appearance on American Pickers in March 2020. While he was away from the program, Frank dropped 65 pounds. He went to Iowa for 77 days to become sober, he told the U.S. Sun. Frank discussed his rift with co-star Mike in an interview he gave to the U.S. Sun in 2021. According to Frank, it's been two years since they last spoke. He should have called to see how I was doing after discovering my back was in a bad spot. That's the way things are. He is getting a tenfold advantage in the show. To demonstrate how much, I cannot even stoop to that level. No problem. Aerosmith is basically a band with Steven Tyler as the lead singer. So now I'm in second place on the show, and he's in first. I'm not bothered by that. Perhaps he is.